guys, welcome back to my channel and today is another episode of Boredom Busters. Just because we have to stay at home because of this craziness that's happening in the world right now does not mean we have to be bored. So today, I'm going to be testing out at home photo hacks. To see which ones work and which ones don't. So, let's get started. Oh, wait. Before we get started, we're going to do a like button challenge. You have to press the like button with your hmm, nose. And if that doesn't work, just press the button with your finger. You've got five seconds. All right, ready? Five, four, three, two, one. Did you do it? If you did, give yourself a pat on the back. All right, now let's actually get started. Okay, so the first at-home photo hack is what I like to call fairy princess because everybody loves to feel like a princess sometimes, if you know what I mean. Hopefully it's not just me. Okay, got awkward. All right, <laughs> basically I'm going to take these fairy lights which are very popular right now. I have them on the background of me. I'm going to use them and wrap them around my hair and in my hair and hopefully it'll look really cool and really pretty and I won't look like a Christmas tree. <laughs> So, it's gonna be, hopefully it works. some really cute shots out of this because it's kind of itchy and by the way you might want to bobby pin it it just makes it look a lot better because on my fairy lights they have a lot more string than light if that makes sense i don't know if that makes sense but they have a lot more plasticiness anyway we just like to bobby pin it it just makes it a lot easier and they don't fall off your head so mom can you unpin them huh mom can you unpin them sure oh, oh okay all right the next at-home photo hack, I like to call it under arrest because it looks like police lights and it's kind of scary. You may be wondering, how do I get these on my phone? All you have to do is Google whatever colors you want and crop it and flip it and there you go. You've got these two colors. Now you want to put them on the sides of your face or down here or here. You can just experiment whatever you want so that it looks super cool. And the last thing you have to do, turn off the lights. Voila. I call this next at-home photo hack, Dreamy Drama. It's pretty dreamy, and it's a little dramatic. Wow! Now you may be wondering, how do I do that? I'm gonna teach you right now. Take the cap off, that would be important. Then, I'm going to take some clear tape. I had to use this like, packaging tape because we didn't have any regular clear tape, but it works, same thing, tape is tape, you know? So I'm just gonna take a little piece and make sure that you're taping the edges you never want to touch the lens. You do not want to ruin that. It's expensive, very expensive. And then you're gonna, you're gonna take the top and then you're gonna take the bottom. So it's not in the middle so your eyes aren't blurry. You don't want that. I'm going to color the pieces. I took these two markers. I'm taking the orange one and a red one. You can do any colors you want. I just chose red and orange. You're just going to take the cap off. And draw. Make sure that the tape is not touching the lens and do not get any of the color on your lens. Expensive camera. Just, just don't do it. Just don't. Now we're gonna take the red Crayola. Not sponsored. And voila, time to take the pictures. The next at-home photo hack I call Frozen. Just fill a clear cake pan with ice and just lay down, take the picture, hope for the best. Watch your finger. Cheese! So far these at-home hacks have been 
working really, really well. This video is a win-win situation because I get to make a YouTube video and I get some awesome pictures for Instagram. But most importantly, I'm keeping you guys from getting really bored at home. This one I call Secret Strainer. Because no one will know how you got this awesome picture. All you have to do is turn your flashlight on, the lowest it gets, and your phone, put it in the middle of your strainer, like right here, then you put it from far away from your face, don't go like this with it, because that's not gonna work, trust me, we tried it and it failed miserably and it looked really weird, but moving on. <laughs> All you have to do is put it away from your face, the closer the strainer gets to your face, the smaller the holes, and the further away, the bigger the holes, so let's try it. Important note, the strainer is not in the picture. Just shine your light through it and take the picture from the other side. Sadly, this is the last at-home photo hack, but I think it's gonna be the best. I call it rose water. Even though we don't use rose water, it's just, you know, it's called rose water. Yeah, you get it. All you need is a bathtub full of water and roses. And dress however you would like. I chose this grand dress because I thought it went with the mood. Now I'm just going to dump these roses in there. That was even more fun than I thought it would be. And now I have all these awesome pictures for Instagram. It's definitely a good boredom buster for you to try. Pop that boredom bubble. Gone, no more boredom. All right, thank you so much for watching Boredom Busters with Lily Kay. I hope you enjoyed it. If you did, give it a big thumbs up and subscribe to my channel. Oh, you, you just have to press the button. It's that easy. And press the notification bell so you get notified every single time I post a new video. All right, bye, love you. Mwah.